The number one ranked 3A Thatcher Eagles flew into Tucson on Friday to battle with the 4A Saguaro Cougars, and we've got all the highlights fit to view. Roadrunner Rehab has been helping Gila Valley residents and athletes achieve their peak performance for over 30 years. They are now offering occupational therapy and adult speech therapy to assist in all your rehabilitation needs. Whether they're getting you back to work or back on the field, they're here to help you. Thatcher opened it up right away on the first play of scrimmage as Cody Jones makes his way through a big hole and he's gone. He's at the 40, the 30, the 20. Nobody's going to catch him as Jones takes the opening handoff 50 55 yards to pay dirt to put Thatcher up 7-0 after the Gavin Rogers extra point. Saguaro faced a tough third down early, but Angel Hightower hooked up with Vincenzo Orlando for the big pass and catch to move the chains. Thatcher faced its own early tough third down, and Aiden Bingham zipped around the right side to pick it up and keep the drive alive. Later on the same drive, it's Bingham again taking it down to the 8-yard line for a first and goal. And wouldn't you know it, on the very next play, who else but Bingham takes it across the line and Thatcher's up early over Saguaro, 14 to nothing. Thatcher's defense then forced a punt, and the galloping golden locks of Coy Ferris returned it all the way back to the Cougars' 40-yard line for good starting field position yet again. And on the ensuing play, quarterback Brandon Napier goes on an epic scramble. He drops back to pass but can't find anyone, so he starts dancing. And then whoop, major miss, and Napier's off to the races as he reverses his field and comes back to the left, and he's got one man to beat as he goes a crawl the way and dives in the end zone for the incredible score. Well, shoot, dang, hang on a second. The ref said number 16 here got blocked in the back, so... Take the points off the board and move it back 10 yards from the infraction. No matter, two plays later, Cody Jones gets lost in the shuffle and zips 17 yards into the end zone for Thatcher's third score of the opening quarter to go up 21 to nothing. Optimal Health Systems in Pima is the original whole food supplement company with its high potency whole food formulas absorbable at the cellular level. Come in to OHS today and try our blend of supplements that thousands of doctors and athletes have used for decades. The Cougars started to finally get it going on offense as Hightower hits Daniel Cruz for the first down. Then on 4th and 10 at the start of the second quarter, Hightower hit Cruz again for the first and to put the Cougars in the red zone for the first time on the night. Saguaro then got on the board as Cruz takes the shovel pass from Hightower and hightails it in the end zone. He's met at the goal line by Ferris, and the ball comes out, but Christopher Apoletigi falls on it, and Saguaro has points, but is still down 7-21. A busted play then led to a sack, and Saguaro's defense stepped it up on third down and read the screen perfectly to force Thatcher to punt for the first and only time on the night. With momentum on their side, the Cougars move the ball down the field as James Webb converts on third down. But the Thatcher defense stiffened up in the red zone as Damian Oreo introduced himself to Hightower. But on fourth down, Hightower finds a wide open Dylan Thomas who comes down with the ball to give the Cougars a first down and goal as halftime approaches. Webb then took the direct snap in Wildcat formation, but the Eagles aren't having none of that as they smothered him at the three. However, Hightower found Thomas in the end zone for the score, and Saguaro cut it to 14-21 with only 44 seconds left until halftime. Whether you need regular pest control or have bigger problems including termites or bed bugs, Rattlesnake Exterminating is your one call to handle them all. Killer bees threatening your family? Then give Rattlesnake Exterminating a call at 485-8904. Doesn't seem like much time to mount a momentum-stopping drive, but the Eagles got off to a nice start as Bryce Larson brought the ball out to midfield. Napier then dropped back and did a twirl and uncorked a deep ball to Brett Jones, who's got the ball in the red zone. Then on first and goal from the five with just 12.5 seconds left, Thatcher gets stuffed by Saguaro. After a missed pass, Thatcher has just three-tenths of a second left on the clock. So what does Coach Jones dial up? Napier calmly drops back and sends one on a line to Tanner Rios, who catches the five-yard TD pass to stop the bleeding and instead double up Saguaro at the half, 28-14. The third quarter started out okay for Saguaro as Hightower connects with Webb, who bobbles it but then gathers it for the nice game. However, the drive stalled and they were forced to punt. Jalen Grigsby then drove it deep, reversing the field nicely. 
Kai knows Hawaiian Grill is the spot in Thatcher to enjoy healthy Hawaiian food with a friendly atmosphere and great service. Order in person or by the phone or online to see the tasty treat everyone is talking about. That's Kainoa's Hawaiian Grill. The Eagles gave it to Ferris and the hard running back gave Thatcher some breathing room with a big pickup. Two plays later, Napier makes a good read and pitches it to Ferris and he's gone. He's at the 40, the 30, the 20. He tiptoes down the sideline all the way for a 62 yard touchdown and Thatcher starts to break away early in the third up 35 to 14. After another punt, it was Aiden Bingham's turn as he took the handoff and made a couple of cuts before stiff-arming his way down the sideline. And on the very next play, nobody wants any part of Bingham, and he goes untouched 25 yards to pay dirt to put the Eagles up 42-14, still in the third quarter. Saguaro tried a quarterback change with Cruz hefting them in the third, but he got a rude welcome from Napier who snagged the INT and brought it back into Cougars territory. Starting from the 25, it took just one play for Cody Jones to end up back in the end zone. And yes, that's right, for the one, two, third time on the night. The snap for the extra point skipped on the ground, but Howard was Johnny on the spot and scooped it up and ran it in for two to put Thatcher up 50 to 14. The Cougars finally gave their fans something to cheer for with Hightower back at quarterback as he hoisted one deep to Vincenzo Orlando who came down with the big completion. But Thatcher's relentless front line just wears down opponents, and eventually, they're gonna get you. Saguaro then nicely set up a screenplay, but Bingham is there like a missile to dislodge the ball from the player. The Cougars recovered, but it was fourth down, and they ended up turning it over. To cap off the night in the fourth, Thatcher decided to air it out, and Napier hit Oreo in stride, and Damian did the rest, brushing off a would-be tackler for a 40-yard TD, as the Eagles come to Tucson and destroy the Saguaro Cougars. 57 to 14. With amenities designed to keep patients comfortable and relaxed, Copper Hills Dental is your choice for anxiety-free dentistry. Visit our website and Facebook page or simply call 428-2750 to schedule your appointment today. That's Copper Hills Dental. You guys uh, mercy ruled the 4A team in Tucson. How does that feel tonight? It felt pretty good. Like I said, we started off really well, then we kind of lulled in the middle. We want to try to iron that out, but uh, I, you know, we played well tonight. That was a great third quarter for us. We, we you know, we kind of talked about a few of the things we missed on, but just the low. We got to try to iron that out. It was uh, wonderful to go six and zero, oh, and we're looking to keep going. Go Eagles! You know, our running back coaches teach us on the lane. You know, do our thing, kind of. So I kind of just went out there after halftime, made a realization, and then went and scored. So honestly, that's pretty much it for the score. How's it feel to come in here to Tucson and mercy rule the 4A tomorrow? Uh, it feels pretty good, honestly. It's uh, it's what our team's supposed to do. We're on track to go take state, hopefully. So, I mean, it's what we're supposed to do. Flawless, our line did great, ever performed. So. Reporting from Tucson for the Gila Herald, I'm John Johnson.